Hi, I'm Kumar Ramakrishna. I'm an Associate Professor and Head of Policy Studies at RSIS. Before this, I was Head of the Centre of Excellence for National Security, or SENS, for nine years between 2006 and 2015. In terms of teaching, I teach a course uh, for the master's class here on countering religiously motivated terrorism in Southeast Asia. The class is a multinational class, uh, Singaporeans, uh, students from the ASEAN countries, uh, from uh, uh, the East Asian countries, as well as Australia, Europe, and further a few. So it's a really rich, uh, textured, multinational experience in terms of the class, uh, not just my class, but uh, frankly all the classes in RSIS. In terms of my research, I have two broad areas of interest. As a historian, I research into uh, British propaganda in the Malayan emergency. So I've looked at propaganda campaigns by the British in Malaya, and I've tried to apply the lessons, so to speak, of uh, such propaganda campaigns uh, to uh, current counterinsurgencies, for example, in uh, Iraq and Afghanistan. Uh, in terms of uh, my other area of research, I also uh, study uh, violent uh, extremism and I uh, try to look into ways and means in which uh, violent uh, extremism or the type that we are experiencing in Southeast Asia and certainly in the Middle East and South Asia can be countered using not just uh, kinetic means or force, but also non-kinetic means, including uh, the, the use of uh, counter-ideological approaches. Uh, my work is relatively eclectic. In fact, in my recent book on uh, terrorism, I look at uh, various uh, multi-perspectival approaches to the study of uh, countering violent extremism. And this particular book, just came out last year. It's called uh, Islamist Terrorism and Militancy in Indonesia, The Power of the Manichaean Mindset. And uh, it's uh, a quite a multi-perspectival or multidisciplinary approach to the topic, uh, which is uh, quite uh, unique as far as Southeast Asian terrorism studies is concerned. In terms of my first area of research, which is historical, as I mentioned, uh, my most recent work in this regard is uh, Original Sin, which looks at uh, what I call revisionist historians' attempts to uh, portray uh, the communist threat in Singapore and Malaya <coughs> in a, a non-mainstream way, uh, so to speak. And uh, I attempt to sort of uh, reinforce that the communist threat in uh, Singapore and Malaya was uh, a real and most significant uh, concern for the uh, incumbent authorities of the day and therefore had to be counted. Uh, and in fact, if one wants to understand the current setup in Singapore and Malaya, uh, one should uh, take cognizance of what happened in the 1950s and 1960s, the Cold War and the communist threat. So these are my two broad areas of research. Uh, the historical aspect as well as the contemporary aspect. Um, I would encourage all of you to consider studying in RSIS. The school is very uh, multinational. Uh, we have uh, great teachers here. We have uh, excellent researchers working on a range of fields in international relations, international studies and uh, history as well. And uh, it promises to be a most uh, enriching experience. Thank you very much.